Hello everyone, welcome back to another video lesson. Today's lesson for grade 5, chapter 11, lesson 10, convert metric units of length. Page number is uh, 857. Guys, before starting today's lesson, don't forget to subscribe my channel, Learn Math with Mr. Saad, and also press the bell icon to get notified for every new video. Okay, let us start today's lesson. Uh, before starting, you guys have to memorize these three lines in this table. Uh, I hope you already know about it. One centimeter is equal to 10 millimeters. And one meter is equal to 100 centimeter. Now, if one centimeter is 10 millimeters, 100 centimeter, 100 times 10, 1000 millimeters. So, one meter is equal to 1000 millimeters also. And one kilometer is equal to 1000 meters. So, uh, we will use these things in today's lesson. You guys have to memorize it. And you know that whenever we are converting from larger unit to a smaller one, we multiply. Okay. And from a smaller one to larger one, we divide. So let us start the lesson today. Uh, here, one of the largest recorded pythons measured 7.3 meters long. What is the length of the python in centimeters? Now, 7.3 meters we have to convert it into centimeters one meter is 100 centimeter 7.3 times 100 okay uh if you guys remember here they multiplied it but if you guys remember i told you once that whenever we are multiplying any decimal by 10 100 or 1000 what do we do? We just count the number of zeros, let's say 10, so 1. So we move the decimal towards right one time. If we are multiplying by 100, two zeros, so we move the decimal two times. When we move it one time, it becomes 73 and the digits finish, so, so we put zero and move it another time, so it becomes 730. Similarly, we are dividing, we move the decimal towards left. I hope you guys remember that. Okay. Let us move to the next page. Uh, Roshanda has 50 dominoes. Each domino is 4 cm long. So 50 times 4, that is 200 cm. How many meters is this? Uh, 1 meter is 100 cm. Uh, 2 meters. 200 centimeters okay uh, 5 meters 500 centimeters 5 times 100 1 kilometer is 9 is 1000 meter so 9000 meter divide by 1000 because we are converting from a smaller unit to larger one so 9000 divided by 1000 9 kilometers okay uh, 700 centimeters, 700 divided by 100, that is 7 meters. 8,500 millimeters, 1 meter is 1,000 millimeter. On the first page of the lesson, we saw that. So, divide by 1,000, 8.5 meters. 15 kilometers, 15,000 meters, uh, 73 kilometers, 73,000 meters. 2.71 meter how many millimeters we are divide multiple times it by 1000 so 1000 have three zeros we'll move the decimal three times the digit finish so we put zero and move it another time okay 9.2 meters how many centimeter 100 so times it by 100 so move the decimal two times okay from centimeters to millimeter okay one centimeter is 10 millimeters so here we will divide by 10 because we are converting from smaller unit to larger one when we divide we move the decimal towards left so move it one time because dividing by 10 and 10 has only one zero okay here 
this much kilometers into meter divide by thousand thousand have three zeros move the decimal sorry times it by thousand so move the decimal three times Uh, guys also solve these questions and then match your answers from this video okay here you have to measure the length of this bar okay and then you have to tell them that how much it is less than one meter so when you put your uh, ruler here you will see that it is four centimeters and in one meter it is 100 centimeters so how many less how much less than one meter 96 centimeters which is the most reasonable estimate for the depth of a lake six millimeters six centimeters or six meters of course uh, six millimeters and six centimeters are too small so that is six meters for the depth of a lake how many five millimeter long spiders would it take to make a line of spiders one meter long one meter is 1000 millimeters so if we divide uh, 1000 millimeters into groups of five uh, 1000 divided by five that is 200 spiders circle the measure that does not belong of course this is 35 kilometers too big the remaining all are small okay i hope you guys understand the lesson uh don't forget to like this video subscribe my channel learn math with mr saad and also send me the homeworks through pioneer have a nice day thank you so much guys